Check out what's trending across your social media feeds this Monday morning. Rachel Roller joining us now. So Rachel Kanye West, he was mixing Easter with Coachella, and that's where you get Sunday service. So his wife, Kim Kardashian, has been yeah. posting their Sunday services online since about the beginning of the year with their daughter, Northwest, kind of jamming out. Looks like we're kind of jamming out yeah. with this uh, shaky shot here. Not sure where we're going to go from here, but maybe we could get this video. There, there we go. Take a look. So this is Kanye at his Sunday service at Coachella. Yes, they brought it there, and it was packed. So many people but that's not even what people were talking about. Whether he mixed his supporters with his religion or his politics, what everyone wanted to talk about yesterday was the price of his souvenirs, you guys. Take a look. We always see Kanye in a sweatshirt, right? Well, that sweatshirt, one like this, it says, trust God, Holy Spirit, or any of these fairly simple sweatshirts are gonna cost you $225. And Ben, you're a socks guy. The socks you see right above my head right here, just as simple, $55. So that was the big talker from Sunday service at Coachella yesterday. Also, people are talking about the fact that you really don't like to pay extra for your bags at the airport, right? I just went through this coming back from Italy, trying to stuff all the bottles of wine in my bag, and then they tell yeah. you, you owe them $100. Oops. What? All right, so Natalie, she's 30 years old. She's a genius. I wish I thought of this. She actually layered all her clothes on from her suitcase. You can see here, she took it all out, put it all on, and that way she saved herself $85, you oh, guys. Oh, uncomfortable, though. She said she was unbearably hot on the plane. I'm Boiling sure. is what I think the term she used. But hey, she has a little extra spending cash on her vacation. The poor person sitting next to her. <laughs> right? She's just like filled with clothes yeah. and sweating. All right, so this may be a little bit of music to yours. Ben and Caroline, I think you'll like this one. Larry, you're pretty, you know, safe when it comes to this. But uh, mm -hmm. swearing might actually be good for you. See? There but you go. Blankety there blank. is a catch, so wait for it. So if you've ever stubbed your toe and you kind of blurted out that beep, that your mom would yell at you for, that may actually help reduce the pain. This study shows that, but only, only if you don't swear often and only if you only use it in those cases. So if it's like in every other word for you, this isn't gonna help with the pain. So this okay. doesn't help us. Here, okay. I, I, wanna know, I, want, I wanna know folks at home, what do you use as an alternate? Like Hannah, Hannah? says, oh beans. oh beans, oh beans. I can't even with that, like, I know. that's just ridiculous. It's, but it's so endearing about her. So use the hashtag yeah, yep. WakeUpCLT and let us know what your, you know, your safe alternative it, is. Exactly, when you get creative. I just don't You think, don't bother with you it. You think about it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Rachel, thanks.